I do not love you as if you were salt rose or topaz, or the arrow of carnations the fire shoots off. I love you as certain dark things are to be loved, in secret between the shadow and the soul. I love you as the plant that never blooms, but carries in itself the light of hidden flowers. Thanks to your love, a certain solid fragrance risen from the earth lives darkly in my body. I love you without knowing how, or when, or from where. I love you straightforwardly, without complexities or pride. So I love you because I know no other way. Finally, the day we have all been waiting for is here. Zara, where do I even begin? I remember when you first told me about Abbas. I knew there was something special about him by the way you spoke about him to me. This past year, I have had the pleasure of getting to know Abbas, and I can see why you make such a wonderful couple. I'm sure Abbas having a British accent is an added bonus. Abbas, my younger brother, has grown into a smart, generous, and caring equal. It is an honor to know the person he has become. He has a heart the size of Vancouver and an innate sense of good. And I know our father would be proud to see the man he has become. Although I wasn't given enough time with my parents, I've been told that their love for each other was of the truest form. I was fortunate that I had other role models throughout my life to help me establish a foundation of love. Sarah, I am sure that today our mother and father are looking down on all of us with their hearts full of joy and happiness. <laughs> أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين قبلت النكاح والتزويج لنفسي على المحر المعلوم والشرط المعلوم Congratulations to you and to Sister Zahra and to your families. I know you've been through some exceptional testing times in your life, and I I only wish that I was there all those years ago to go through those with you. Now during these difficult moments, it helps for us to be optimistic, to have a positive outlook at life, to be hopeful in life, to believe that things inshallah will get better. For the first time, I would like to introduce Mr. and Mrs. Ritansi. She is the light of my eyes, and you truly are, Zara. You truly are the light of my eyes. You bring me such happiness. So, Abbas Rathansi, the love of my life, let's do this. Let's make this happen. Ready or not, here we go. You will forever be my always, and I am so grateful to call you my husband. I love you with all of my heart. 